From the depths of the BEA comes a tidal wave of terror. You've endured the onslaught of government propaganda. You've witnessed the colossal waste of taxpayer money. Now, experience the most exhilarating hour and a half of your life. Then, go out and watch the movie, The War of the War on Drugs, coming at you in two dimensions. Be the first to see the most incredible motion picture ever made. And if you can't be the first, be the second. And if not the second, well, you get the idea. Watch in living color, except for the black and white scenes, the untold rewards of illicit drug use. So just because all your friends don't do drugs doesn't mean you have to be a sheep and mindlessly follow. No, I... I guess I don't. Witness unspeakable horror! Behold terror like you've never seen before! Check this out. My dad's got a bazooka in here. Cool. Observe political intrigue! Suppose Congressman Bob Barr wanted to hire a male prostitute off the street. If he used the entire United States War on Drugs budget to fund his hypothetical deviant behavior, he could receive oral sex two and a half billion times before he'd have to use his own money. Gazed at the art of seduction. Here's your drink. It tastes weird. Bring up. I don't know. What did you put in this? Uh, prune juice, tonic, vodka. And roofies. Oh, all right. Stay awake for visions of the future. Oh, you mean the 21st century. Yes, Daddy, the 21st century. The time when people thought that everything that offended their senses was good, and that which pleased them was bad. And view the mind-crushing insanity of a world without drugs. All this and finger puppets. Hey, Grandma! In the war on the war on drugs. Yes, I really do talk like this.